Welcome back to the Pink Floyd Collector's YouTube channel. So finally on Friday, we saw the release of Pink Floyd Animals 2018 Remix. I picked up the vinyl copy as I've got the full box set coming in October. So I just wanted to unpack this in front of everyone, uh, show you what the vinyl experience is like. Obviously comes sealed, hype sticker on the front. Personally, I never fully open these. I keep the cellophane on the outside. Just something I've done over the years. Um, but it is a double album. Ah, so let's see what comes inside. So, so the upper sleeve contains the full booklet. So this just features some original photography from the 1976 shoot. I think it was uh, November, December, 76. So some nice original photos, obviously in a 12, 12 inch square booklet. Feels nice, good quality. But yeah, all original photos. And then the band members from the time. And a few bits of uh, memorabilia there. The uh, invite to the playback. Could even be mine, this one. Yeah, probably is. Glenn's probably sent my copy of it. And then, yeah, this is my one as well. The uh, pass, uh, crowd pass. That's good to see them in there. Couple of uh, artwork, inflatables that appeared on that tour. And yeah, credits page, the upturned Battersea Power Station. Yeah. Famous Pink Floyd live here, which I think from memory appeared in the Wish You Were Here songbook first of all. I don't think it was in the animals from memory. So that's the first sleeve. And we've got the actual record itself. And take it out. Wow, feels obviously nice and heavy, 180 grams. And as you can see, they've used the uh, original so this hasn't been updated. It's the dog on the back, yeah. So it's exactly the same as the original 1977 release. Feels nice though, really heavy, very firm. So yeah, nice to finally hold in my hands and obviously I'll give a play soon. I have listened to it on Spotify, so I'm familiar with the uh, remix. I think it sounds good. There's a lot of different panning, and uh, in uh, certain parts, I think Nick Mason's drums sound excellent, as does a lot of Rick's work, actually. I think a lot of that comes through. The synths have been upped in the mix. I'm really starting to wonder whether there's something new in there. I wonder, because I know they've gone back to the master tapes, but for me, there's, is there really stuff in there that I've never heard before? I really need to dig maybe deep into the original uh, but yeah, finally on our shelves, just have to wait another three, three and a half weeks, I think it is, till the uh, box set comes out. But that's the Pink Floyd Animals 2018 remix on vinyl.